Glad you're here. And we're glad that you actually want to take apart your pump so that you can clean it. In this video, we're going to go over the disassembly and reassembly of the extreme stream pump or wave pump. And in the middle of that, we'll also go over things to look for when you pull out the impeller. I guess you're asking yourself, is this going to be a big process? The answer is no, it's not going to be a big process. It's actually quite easy. This is the pre-filter guard. You're going to take one of your hands, you're going to press until this piece right here starts to rise, and then you're going to pull forward. That pulls off the pre-filter guard. Now you can visually inspect the fins or the propeller blades along with the rest of the pump. As you can see, if you look very closely, there is a lock and unlock visual representation right here on the front blade. So you simply unlock and pull straight out. That is how you remove the impeller. Why would you do that? To clean. Now you're gonna put this in pump clean or your favorite aquarium product cleaner. Now, you're gonna visually inspect the inside, making sure that there's no issues, debris, things that could be impeding or hindering the rotation of this impeller. And then you're going to inspect this impeller. You're gonna look at the magnet, the shaft, the blades, making sure everything is in proper working order. Then, you can let this soak in pump clean. You've done a little brushing, you look through it, and you put it back together. In reverse, it's that easy. Simply take this, grab the impeller, and it actually will pull itself right in. You use the lock and unlock mechanism, you can hear it click in, and then you rotate to the lock position. Now you can see that it is locked in place. And then this, the pre-filter guard, has a catch hook on the bottom. You take the pre-filter guard, which also has an indentation, you catch it to the hook, and then you push back. That's it. Simple as that. We've just disassembled and reassembled the extreme pump. That's it. Plain and simple. It's done. Now, why would I want to do any of this? Well, you probably want to do some of this if you were doing some maintenance. Maybe you were noticing that the flow wasn't as strong because there's a lot of buildup. And well, maybe you should be doing this periodically to make sure that the pump is in proper working order. And always remember that the Extreme from CJ, made in Italy, comes with a five year guarantee. And the magnet, whew, it's pretty strong. Keep your fingers out of there. We hope you found this video very informative. We hope that you learned a couple of things and we hope that you now will clean and maintenance your pumps so that they can live the longest life and provide your living creatures with the absolute best performance. Thank you so much for watching. You know what's next. Follow the whale.